kind of like Willy Wonka in these things. Maybe? No? Um, so I have a little bit of a rant. And I mean this with all the love in the world. Um, yeah. So, I went to go get my mail today. And I get out of the car. And I'm just running in to check my mail. But, when I go to check my mail, I park the car. And then I get out and I go inside pharmacies. And I get my mail. And then I come back in. And it takes me all of maybe five minutes. But I still park the car because there's this big lengthy space in front of Pharmasave, which is yellow stripes, so it's a no park zone, and it's meant for deliveries or emergencies. And yet, for some reason, people assume this is the quick stop shop area. So today I got out, and not only were there two trucks in that area, but there was also a truck that pulled over and kind of half parked in a parking spot and half parked in the middle of the lane because that other quick stop area was clearly full and so they were just going to park there even though there was kind of already a car in that spot and they were just going to put their hazards on like it was okay so I want to know to these people to all you people out there who think it's okay to quickly stop in an area that's painted yellow, and this could be different depending on where you live. In Canada, it's painted yellow to showcase, you know, it's an emergency only zone, or it's a bus zone, or it's a drop off zone, and you have to have a special permit to be there. Why do you think it's okay to park in these areas? Let me tell you one day, you are going to be in that shop, and an ambulance is going to be needed to call for you, okay? Let's just say. And they're not going to be able to pull up because somebody is going to be in that area. Just you wait. So, Mr. Bob, or whatever your name is. Everybody's always hated on Bob. Have you noticed that? Bob is the go-to name. You are going to be having a heart attack inside a farm safe. And somebody else will be parked in that area because they will have learned from tons of other people parking in that area that it's okay. And then when that ambulance comes to save you because you're having a heart attack, there isn't going to be a spot for them to park properly or throw in a quick stop properly. And then that extra, even if it's 10 seconds, 5 seconds, that they have to take, it's going to increase the likelihood of your death. That's the way I think of it. There's a reason why we're not allowed to stop there. There's a reason why it's painted yellow. And there's a reason why you have to pay a bunch of money to legally park there. Just going to throw that out there. So, I think next time you should think about it, because in all of that five minutes that it took me to get out of my car and go inside and get the mail, all three of you were still there. So I was there for less amount of time, and yet I could park. And it's because I think about these things. I think about what are the chances. Do I really want to risk it? I don't think so. And to be honest, if I have had a heart attack, and the ambulance needs to come get me, and you three fuckers were out there parked in their area... I would probably turn around and sue you if it was legal. I'm not really sure. I'm not a legal person, but let me tell you. I would be extremely pissed off if I had brain damage. Well, I probably wouldn't be able to tell if I had brain damage, right? But you get my point. My point is, is you're risking people's lives by being in that zone. So unless you have the permit, you need to fuck off. And there, there are the exceptions to this rule. I drove farther down, and there was this area outside the bay where this... This man pulled up ever so slightly onto the curb because he was letting his wife with crutches get in. That makes sense. But he wasn't there the whole time. He waited in the parking spot until he saw her come to the door. Then he went and he pulled up and he helped in the car. That makes total sense. But don't stand there forever. It's just so stupid. Okay, I'm going to stop yelling at my monitor now. Do like the Willy Wonka glasses? I just need to get that off my chest. And it's 